three more days. <laughs> three more days of fundraising for Extra Life this year. If you'd like to help out with a donation, all you need to do is type in exclamation point donate, donate in chat for a link. The bot will produce one for you. Or you can just scroll down underneath the video screen and click on the Extra Life button. Take you to the same place. Any amount you choose to give to to Extra Life is, or more specifically, my local children's hospital, Radio Children's Hospital of San Diego. Um, any money you choose to donate is very much appreciated and goes to, of course, a great cause. If you have any questions about Extra Life or children's hospitals and how they work, feel free to ask. I'll do my best to answer. Okay, so here we are. We just uh, claimed this ship. This was a, basically, it's a wreck. So we claimed it, and now we're going to strip it clean as much as possible. <laughs> and then we're going to go investigate that uh, this derelict to the to the side of us here. We haven't looked at it yet, mainly because dum dum dum. We have a bunch of wounded people from our last little expedition onto a ship that was totally infested, and we were lucky to get out of there. <laughs> our people are really not combat oriented. We only have one person that's good with guns; the other three not so much, and we only have. Anyway, a shotgun and three pistols between the four of them anyway, so not real good at fighting stuff. But anyway, we're going to try to strip this thing as down as much as we can for the materials, and hopefully it gives us enough to... Uh, dump, 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 what is it? Uh, we need to build a medical bed, but we're short on one spit, one thing. We need a, uh, a tech block, and this will help people heal up. We do have... Uh, do we have medication? We have band. We have medical supplies. Yeah, we have some uh, medical supply stuff, but um, we need to build a bit bed first before that happens. Dun, dun, dun. So, doing that, and we do have uh, four solar panels built on this ship. Finally, that's basically pulling up most of the power requirements. Generating 11. This generator is currently off, but these guys are producing uh, 12 energy units per second. Batteries are pretty much full, so we're handling our uh, usage of uh, our uh, energy requirements currently. And we've got a shipping coming. Android Collective. No big deal. As far as food goes, we're we're down to eating uh, algae because <laughs> we can't grow our own food yet. And again, this is the um, uh, this is a new scenario they introduced with Alpha 13, which is did come out last week or the week before, somewhere around there. And um, basically, what it is is they give you this nice little ship to play around with first, so you don't have to build one from scratch. And it's got all the the basics. It doesn't have any food production though. Um, doesn't have any, you know, solar panels. You have to research all that stuff in order for that to happen. Um, so, you know, you got to build it up to get to the point where you're a little bit more self-sufficient, yeah, which we're getting there. It's taking time. But they give you all the necessary pieces and parts in order to do that. Like, um, you start off with this research research lab and a research, research workbench, which is a new item. And you also get uh, stuff or credit for uh, salvaging certain pieces of equipment now to the help that um, you get credit for uh, in the research tree, which they've messed around with. Well, I should messed around. They've worked on, made it a little different than it was. But again, when you salvage stuff from derelicts, um, you get credit. If you don't already know what that technology, if you haven't researched that technology already, you get a couple of points or whatever to go towards researching it when you do get there. So these guys, you don't really need to talk to them because this is our main concern right now. Again, we're just breaking everything down over here for the parts. That. It's already set up to dismantle. It's a wall light. Sure. Thermal regulator. Sure. But yeah, we got kind of lucky here because we got um, this hull stabilizer, which is going to be good for a few parts when we when dismantle it. There was a generator in here too. It's going to be helpful. Let's 
So a thermoregulator. Kitchen. Kitchen with no food in it, right? So the ship's already left the sector. Too bad it wasn't a medical bed in here. It would have been kind of helpful, but it's okay. Another kitchen. Multiple kitchens. Navigation console. That'll be good for some parts. Again, if we really wanted to, we could, you know, patch all the holes in this and turn it into a second ship for us, but we don't want to waste all that material. It's easier just to uh, break it down for parts. Like we can even break down the walls too. Take a little while. And actually we're running out of storage too. About a hundred more there, but it's more about the mass on this ship because it's already up to almost 2,000 mass. <laughs> the, the engines can only move so much, so we'd have to build some extra engines if, we are, if our mass gets too high. Oh, this is built. Crew member, prisoner, slaves, refugees. Tell them to lay down there, or tell her to lay down there, rest up, I guess. And she's healing. That's what we want. So that's our little med bay. Out in the middle of uh, the hangar. So conditions. Fatty acid stuff. Ate too much. Full health. 98. Good enough. How much longer is she going to be here? Dun -dun. Draft. Draft. So she'll be doing that stuff now. Octavucools, where are you going? Oh, so people are lying down automatically now. That works. The space is there. Hull breach. Oh no, not a hull breach. <laughs> uh, wow, look at that power disappear. Batteries. I'm doing okay. So I only got the one tech block out of, out of that ship. That doesn't seem right. Or they not picked up everything. It's pretty empty. Now this hasn't been done yet. Can you move this all the way over to this other ship? That would be funny. We can't. Damn it. It's metal. It's metal. So, infra blocks, energy blocks, and tech blocks. So, there's two tech blocks there. So, they just have to get that stuff off the ship. air vent. Again, we can take down all the walls, too. Or most of them. For the parts. The question is, do we want them? Because, again, just more mass for us to carry around. Dun, 
Dun, dun, dun. I should have built an airlock. <laughs> Just to make it a little bit faster. Dun, dun, dun. Actually, is it uh, even an option? Airlocks require infra blocks and just a whole block, it looks like. So you could just do it here. Or over here, actually. Cannot build here. Why? Because of the windows? This window screwed everything up. Yeah, downside to not actually, yeah. Uh, I haven't built this thing ourselves. Not the best layout. Anyway. Yeah, I don't even know where an airlock was on this. Doesn't look like it fits anywhere. Infra blocks. So again, we want all these blocks. Everything we want everything here that we're Ping, pinned for being dismantled. We want that to happen because we need the parts. You can't move this. And solar panels doing their jobs. So our generator isn't burning up any uh, resources. Cruels. There you go. Cruels is natural position, laying down, taking a break. <laughs> Too bad he's not here. Uh, Full power. Hello everyone. My name is Veronica and welcome to Gimpy's Twitch channel. If you are enjoying what you are watching, please click the follow button in the lower right corner of the video screen. That way you will be notified by Twitch when Gimpy goes live. You can also follow Gimpy over on Twitter at Gimpy Knee. He tweets out there when he goes live and will more than likely follow you back. Thank you for watching. Yep, they're watching. Happy Thursday. So, I'm just watching the power usage. I don't know why. Well, it's these three batteries. We got a big drain for some reason. What's being used? It's taking up all the power. The melting of the ice. That uses up a lot of power, actually. But, batteries are good.
Should we get some more tech blocks off of that that rack? I know having solar panels is so much nicer. <laughs> we don't have to worry about our our in uh, energarium. It's not a big deal right now. So is it pretty healthy? Seventy-seven, eighty-nine, seventy-two. It was like at a, almost 100% health. What happened? Is it because of the injured protein deficiency? Chronic wound. What if that? Oh, has she not been on the table yet? Is that what's going on? No. Well, that was awfully quick. Not healing on their own and the medical bay to fully recover. Well, that's what we're trying to do. Smoke condition? Yeah. Hey, American. Space Haven 35 33 percent off steam if you didn't know. I did not know that. So now you know. If you like this game or like what you're seeing, keep in mind it is still in early access, but it's currently 33% off on Steam, probably through the weekend. And if you're not sure, you got questions, ask. <laughs> I've been playing the game for, for pretty much from the beginning. I'm a, actually a Kickstarter backer for the game, and so I've had access to it for a long time. And uh, if you got any questions, feel free to ask. I'll do my best. To I'm no, by no stretch of the man, ad, stretch of the imagination, the expert on the game, but I have a pretty good grasp of it and what you need to do and that kind of stuff. And plus, the game is changing because it's still going through development. So, and so again, questions, ask, especially if you're interested in you know thinking you might like it. Okay, so she's healing up, Captain Erica. So that wound is gone at least. So we need more protein in our diets apparently because algae isn't cutting it. Yep. Can we change that? No. Yeah, the protein is just too low in the algae. So you can't really do anything because it's just a plant. this ship look like? Just some pieces and parts. Infrably, but I haven't broken down yet. It yet. So not the best parts. Infra blocks are useful, but not a big deal. Okay. So storage. 202, 250. That one's full. Okay, Captain Erica is back up and moving around. Okay, boys and girls, let's go see what's on that derelict next to us. Look, 
bugs. Stop shooting at stuff. Now shoot at them. Our little space marines. Wanna be space marines. Your money laying around? Sorry, data logs. This isn't money. So, we got to explore this whole derelict, clean out the bugs, and once we do, we can salvage stuff. Nice big engine or generator. Probably it, except for the one that's floating around over there. Take that back. This little friends get up. Oh, multiple little friends. So the open wound thing, that's new. <laughs> that's new for everybody. We do it on oxygen, about halfway. So what this means, we should get dec decent parts out of the med bay. Multiple generators, got a little one there, and the big one back here. So hopefully we get some good stuff out of this one. Not as good as we not as good salvage as the the one that we the ship that we claimed, but you can't claim every ship. But these guys, not too bad. Anyway, we can take all that stuff. So a little bit of food. This is hyperfuel. That's energy crystals and corpses. Take all that stuff and then salvage wise. The energy and the tech for the most part. Everything else is okay. We don't need to take it when we get that stuff first. Okay. Doing on research. Power generators up to 93%. So basically, what this is this generator is an upgrade for this one. It's actually that one right there. That's the one we're currently researching. But we won't build it until we can make uh, energy rods out of the blue crystals. The Mary Shelley. stuff. Except clean that up. We're not really in a rush now because we're eating algae, although it's not the healthy healthiest for us. I wish there's a way to get a some type of protein thing. Oh we could eat people. Settings. How bad do we want to be uh cannibals. Although I don't think we have any Yeah, we don't have actually any body parts because we don't have an autopsy table to chop up the bodies. We do have we do have corpses laying around. But we have no way of chopping them up right now. We are eating algae, Jeff. 
It's just that the problem with the algae is there's no protein in it. So everybody's experiencing a protein deficiency. So that's our main issue, because we don't have any protein in our diets. So power generator. Let's get that. So next is the refinery to make the energy rods for that generator. I guess I should probably look into doing some... Uh, Dun, 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 what I'm looking for uh, botany. So this allows us to build some of our uh, little grow beds so we can grow food. Specifically, we'd use them to grow the protein that we're lacking currently. That's a big one we need. But man, these things are expensive because of the fertilizer. The composter. So basically you have to go botany, composter. Because the composter is what produces the the fertilizer you need. If. But autopsy table. You can always eat people for really hungry. <laughs> uh, human corpses. Body of a decayed human. Holler corpse. Uh, it's only the four types. Mm. Fibers. Oh, this is for making uh, medical supplies and that kind of thing. Hey, Hurricane. Yeah, so in like green, we don't have to go that route, but. Oh, look at this. Advanced research just to get to a composter. Composters aren't that complicated. The question is, is will people be upset if they're chopping up human bodies in order to get for the protein? It's really only one way to find out, isn't there? over there right now. How much do I like each other, I guess? Well, we wouldn't be eating crew members currently. The only We have corpses here that we found on other ships. Because we have three human cor corpses and then seven alien corpses there. And this one, we have a human corpse here too. And five alien corpses. So we could, you know, turn that those humans into, you know, food. It's protein. Protein we desperately need. Who's going to be meal first? Buclos? Do you want them to be? <clears throat> so main thing is this is filling up so much mass. Actually, here's the other engines, ship systems, hyperdrive. We need the, the upgraded versions of these systems. That one. Oh, you can't move. There we go. That work. See, with the botany, we can grow our own uh, protein. I'm sure it's healthy, but 
sure it's fine. Uh, shield, weapon, stuff. So again, hyperdrive. And then two. Oh, see, we've been collecting parts because we've been uh, salvaging, you know, different parts, of different ships and stuff like that. So we already have a little bit of a research going into the hyperdrive. That's what that bar is. So anytime we see a little bit of bar, like the shields console, weapons, that means we've done some salvaging of those parts. Power generator three. That's the big one. Of course, no, we do have uh, the energy refinery. Oh, we've been researching that, never mind. Dun, dun, dun. Logistics are overwhelmed. Oh, I'm the right, John. That's no big deal. Oh, they're doing little experiments up here. And energy. Oh, is this related to... Oh, this is how they're learnt, trying to figure out how to make it. So they're burning through it. They're bringing the, the stuff over here to the workbench so they can basically, I think, reverse engineer it. I don't know why it's got to take so many over there, but... And then he's unsuccessful. The energy refiner. I don't know what exactly they're doing. put this thing in. I don't know exactly what they're moving around from here to here because it doesn't seem to be changing. At all. Hmm. And your refinery fifty one percent. I don't even we're probably gonna spit put it up here. stuff they still have to break down. That's not going to help our research because we already finished that one. I need that get uh, all the way broken down. Let's see, we want to work dismantling. So we should get some research off of that. Uh, schematics information plus four. Get parts to get some tech scrap. Eat that. There's oh, it's scrap. It's not an actual block. It's only scrap. That's right because this is a this is a derelict. So we only get scrap off of this stuff. But 
better than nothing. It's just taking too long to break this ship down. Seventy nine percent on the refinery. Here it's going faster. Patience. I'm trying to be patient. It just takes so long. With only four people, everything goes a little bit slower. And again, it's a small ship too, which is fine. It's a. Uh, if we had a bigger ship, we'd need more people. We haven't run into any more people really. And we got the one one guy with the one dead guy that could have joined us if he hadn't been dead, but you know, dead. <laughs> you even have extra bunks for people. I like how they're using the, the med the med bay automatically, that's kinda neat. It saves me the trouble having to do it. No, I was hoping he wasn't a dead guy. On one of the derelicts, we found a sleeping chamber thing. You know, the the thing they they go into for long trips. And he was there was some there was a body in it. He was like, oh please, please, please. And we opened it up, and he was dead. So it would have been nice to have a fifth person. Huh? You don't run into them that often. And it, it's basically a free crew member. Yeah, poor Tim didn't make it. Love it. Rock lips. Oh, hyperspace chamber logs. There it goes. Tim Shine. He was hoping he'd be in the hypersleep chamber was going to keep him alive. It long enough for him to be rescued. It took too long. Return that product back as defective. Well, really, well, I don't know if it was defective. We don't know how long he was in there. This is Gimpy's home, I think. Yep. Someone with that ship, yeah. You have been naming their kids Tim for centuries? What, in this game? Or in real life? And her three pets. Well, currently it's only two that I can see. I wouldn't be surprised if a third one's in the house, but I don't see her. Okay, looks like we are just stripping off the other stuff now, probably the hole. Okay, I think we're able to move on. our mass 2000 14% oh stage 2 what's the stage 2 stuff why is it two stages Experiment, basic research, and immediate. Uh, ugh. That's taking forever. 
Okay, let's get out of here. Let's go to the system. So more derelicts look like. We're going to go check up the last system over here we haven't been to. So, prepare. You'll be leaving the Rigel behind because that's what it is. It's a junker. Can you jump the following be left behind? It's okay. Got some water. Could always use more water. We have two pods now, too. So it helps the mining go by a little bit faster, even though we only have one decent miner. As soon as those done, we'll go somewhere else. Producing as much uh, power out of the solar panels because we're far away, farther away from the star. Should be okay. No, oh, we're making scrap. There's the big one right there. Or sorry, processing the scrap, which needs to be done. As a salvage ship, you need to process your salvage. Otherwise, it's just junk. Dun, 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 dun. I run out of power, though. <laughs> Batteries are getting drained pretty quick. They're filling up decent. Basis this thousand right there. It's three thousand twenty three batteries. Then we have a fourth battery down here. It's connected right to the generator. That's not running. What's is eating up the power? Assuming eight, we're producing six. Just waiting for the ice. Six more to go. Power is an issue. Unless we're going to turn our generator on, I guess we should. So, generator hey, back bag on. Hey, bag of water. Stretch your legs. You have been sitting in one spot for far too long. We're good. So this generator eats up our little energarium crystals here. Although I guess we could put in our new generator. Now we're done mining. Let's move on to our system.
Okay. So we've explored all the different little planetary bodies. Except for that one uh, totally invested ship, which was so much fun. Where do we want to go? So this is uh, the galaxy as we know it. Safe system. Star system cluster is protected by military alliance. A place for safe commerce. The military alliance will carry out routine inspections in the star, uh, star system cluster. That's fine. She wants to drop. Oh, no. Look here. Okay, off we go. Uh oh. Bark on interstellar travel. Traveling in hyperspace will cause adverse effects for crew members. The hyperspace sleep chamber for each crew member will protect against uh, those side effects. Note the intensity of side effects from traveling in hyperspace are severe only on the harsh and brutal difficulty uh, settings. Peaceful, builder, and medium difficulty settings have a minor effect. Milder effect. They'll be fine. <laughs> They'll be totally fine. You may end up like Tim, but it'll be fine. Your complete scenario, and hence they're not ready to venture out on your own. Expand your ship, build your fleet, whatever happens, if it is up to you to chart your course. Okay. So I think. Batteries are not charged, really. Do an eight per. So what I'm going to do is going to break down this uh, this generator. Stop it. Dismantle it. Oh, actually, let's double check, make sure we can actually build the generator I want to build. That's kind of a good thing to check before we do this. And we've got all the parts. Do we? No, we don't. I double check. We cannot do this yet. Do not dismantle. Damn. We're missing four of the blocks we need in order to uh, build the generator I want to use. Okay. So we're fairly far from a star. Derelict and some energy crystals, so we'll go this way. Looks like there's a base in here. I think, I think that's what the, that is. That looks like a base. Should we attack them? We've got no weapons to attack them with. Anyway, let's mine these crystals. Three of them. Ugh. Are you ready? That's uh venturing. Check out that derelict. It's right there. You want a dock. Hmm, let's dock down here. Got two airlocks on this thing. Go with this one first. We have to with both there. Dun, 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 dun.
Wow, Erica got eaten pretty good there, looks like. Captain Erica, be a little bit more careful. Slow shooting. I wonder if it's because they got protein deficiencies why they shoot so slow. Or it seems like they're shooting slower. You can see these guys because there's a wall, or there's a window in the wall. Reminds you of old school XCOM, kind of. Yeah, it actually kind of does, doesn't it? Wow, Lieutenant Zeon got uh, destroyed there. Let's retreat. Sorry, I'll do that. Craft. Shit, 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 shit. Wonderful. For some reason, she didn't want to drop stuff. Day two. Let's get out of here. That went incredibly smoothly. Beat up everybody else. We only have one med bay table. Okay, we're back. So that went great. <laughs> that went great. They're not dodging very well in their protein deprived uh, bodies. Erica is not doing well. She's still unconscious. So we should have carried it to the table. Oh, good job, Uko, setting fires. Oh, she's up and running now. Right? Captain Erica, you're not supposed to die on us, so go lay on the table for a while. Timmy wasn't nourishing enough? Oh, I don't even know if we have his body. Hello, everyone. We probably do. My name is Veronica, and welcome to Gimpy's Twitch channel. If you are enjoying what you are watching, please click the follow button in the lower right corner of the video screen. That way you will be notified by Twitch when Gimpy goes live. You can also follow Gimpy over on Twitter at Gimpy Knee. He tweets out there when he goes live and will more than likely follow you back. Thank you for watching. Yeah, thank you for watching. Happy Thursday. And we have no way of actually eating people yet, Jeff. We don't have the proper uh, uh, table to cut up body parts. So we can't actually eat people yet. Captain Erica is not doing well. Hey, 
little hungry, low energy, chronic wound two. Oh, this is not going well. Open wounds healed five. Ouch. Oh look, more fire. What the hell? <laughs> We've run out of medical supplies. Some medical supplies on this thing. Uh, so, what's our power situation look like? Turn this thing off for a little while. Conserve our resources. Solar panels must be producing a ton of power, and we're all full. Three, yep. So, we don't need to use our generator in this area. Although we still have to clean out that derelict. And, uh, everybody's all beat to hell. They killed a number of the bugs, but Captain Erica is really bad shape. Power's an issue. Lieutenant Zion, he's beat up too. Stupid protein deficiency. Uh, the interstellar travel sickness. I was forced to travel in hyperspace without a hyperspace sleep chamber for a, for a longer trip. I feel awful. Does that go away eventually? You're very uncomfortable. Somehow I think uh, people need a little bit more rest. So I'm going to modify their schedule a little bit. Give them a little bit more sleep. You say oops quite often. Do you need assistance? Good. Let's see, they're currently sleeping for five hours a day. So let's make it seven. Good time there. There. Uh, do you want them sleeping long? Actually, now let's switch that around. So sleep this way. Time there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven, that, that. Done. There. Okay, so we got a little bit of crossover so they can actually interact with everybody. No rats or vermin to eat on the boat? No. We do have corpses we can eat, but we have no way of chopping them up currently. So she's just sleeping, right? She's, she's totally fine. She's just sleeping. Got a healed open wound. I don't know if that's good or bad. Concerning health problems. Uh, feeling pretty awful on health. Pretty awful health wise. Of course you are. Hopefully, a little bit more sleep will make people feel better. Who knows? Of course, that just means less productivity, too. Okay, we're done mining. What did it say? No safe path or something? Let's 
so you can have no IV fluid. I can't make any either. I could bring the other three over to clear out the, the rest of the bugs. She's getting better. It's taking a little time. She's getting better. Look at all the military guys here. We can make with them? We can. Trade. Oh, let's see. Oh, they got IV fluids. Let's trade with them. Seventeen hundred. What do we have excess of? We got ten of these uh, energy coils. We got whole blocks. Safe trade for now. We need the IV fluids pretty badly. Hopefully, that'll help people get a little bit healthier. So, they're moving stuff over to the airlock for that trade. Searching. Ah, the energy stop. Fifty-eight percent. Incoming message. That beast eighty-four. Thank you for the follow and welcome to the stream. Get the medical stuff yet? Here comes the delivery. Three, I thought we got four. They somebody oh they already grabbed it. Well, that was quick. Oh now we have a vitamin deficiency now. Not a vitamin that's really starting to affect me in many ways. <laughs> so we have a new ship in the system. Maintenance guy. Maintenance guy. That's maintenance guy. Very slow to get there. How much longer is she going to be laying on that table? Because I want to go back over to that derelict. Eating the algae. Need to find some vitamins. Okay. Go. Get on the side. Okay, I don't know what is it? Right next to us, going the wrong way. 
Okay, let's go back over here. So hopefully the bugs don't repopulate. I don't think they do. It didn't look like it was a totally infested ship. Hey, guess we won. Wow, I didn't... Who killed all the bugs? Oh, look, it's just bodies. <laughs> it's just bodies. <laughs> ah. Salvage that stuff. So are they going to come strip this place clean, aren't they? Or are they? Nope. They must have cleaned everything up. Bugs have no protein? Well, we have no way of chopping up the bugs yet. They don't seem to be on the on the menu. This is our kitchen. And settings. Oh, monster meat is actually on there. It's just they have toxins. Look at the toxins in there. We don't want to eat them. Get all the protein there. Oh, this might work. But again, we don't have any human meat currently. Contraband to military lines, so we don't have any, so it doesn't matter. So like eating a blowfish. Yeah, basically. Research. So the autopsy table. We have to put that up there, I think. Meat lock. Why is that long? I wonder why that's the. Uh, Be locked up. Oh, because we haven't got botany first. That's why. There we, go. we have to do this one before we do the autopsy table. It shouldn't take too terribly long to do. But we're looking for. I'm going to salvage all the stuff over here. Although I don't think we're going to have enough room for it. Because you're screwing up the research way too much. It's taking forever to get this stupid generator or refinery done. Fair. They seem to fail more than they succeed sometimes. <laughs> Especially when we were watching them. They just failed two out of three times. One for one. Or sorry, one for two. faster. Tech blocks. I'm tuning for the refinery for that one. A tech scrap. I don't think there's a lot. Is there? 
here there's supposed to be a lot of tech high tech scrap or tech scrap over on the ship, but it seems to be processing a very quick way. Fire. Keep setting fire to stuff. make this uh, a high priority. The door slammer has left the system. Where are you guys? What are you doing? Two people working over in that ship right now doing salvage work. Everybody's healthy again, roughly. As healthy as they're going to get, probably, with their little nutrition deficiencies. Batteries are filling up. This is just such a cool little feature, watching the batteries fill up with power. The colors change, go from red to green. And there are the buffs. Why did it all disappear? What's the hit? No one's here. Two people are sleeping. I wonder how long it takes for them to go crazy from only eating uh, algae. I mean, that's got to be driving them nuts. Two unsuccessful research attempts there. Supposed to be one of our good research people, too. There's two at least. And three gone. So that was two out of five successful research things. Airlock is blocked. Get too much crap in front of it. Thing's basically full. Yeah, things full too. Uh, um, got a lot of scrap. I actually don't have that much scrap in storage. All those metals, base metals. Got a lot of water. <laughs> I just realized that we have a lot of water. Build those engines. Hey, bag of water, stretch your legs. You have been sitting in one spot for far too long. So these engines are actually, well, what is it? We're short on tech blocks. storage. Could expand this out. So the 
this whole area. Nice big bulge, I guess. Coming ship. We're fairly we're safe here. We don't have to worry about any uh, pirates coming in to kick our crap out of us, but. So we got two over on the other ship, two are sleeping, so that's why nothing's going on here. Once they get back from the other ship, they should, should build this area out a little bit, which should give us a little room for storage. I'm hoping. What I'm going to do is move the med bay the med bed up into this quarter area so we can use this space for storage. Two new ships. All part of the same. Cult of New Haven, Military Alliance. <laughs> Airlock locked, we know that. Okay, so we need uh, objects, walls. That, this, why is there a hole there? <laughs> why is there a hole? I don't know why there's a hole. Didn't I say move it? Yeah, I did say move it. Oh, they gotta do it the old fashioned way. But again, why is there a hole? Oh, maybe not. It's a little graphic glitch, no big deal. Oh, and this, we wanna move this to a different spot. Right there, and to build a wall behind that one. Body storage. We got the parts to build that. Large storage. Here, move that to the corner. And then we move the wall. Yep. Now we can't move this until it's empty. So we have uh, some body storage there. <laughs> we have a bunch of corpses sitting around. Guess this will keep them nice and crispy, I guess. As in refrigerated.
there. He's in the menu tonight? For real or here? I don't know. Hey, energy finery is finally done. So botany is next. Then the autopsy table, so maybe? <laughs> maybe? Energy refinery. Do we have the parts for this? We do not. We don't have the tech blocks. to process this stuff. We have tech scrap, don't we? We do. Look, uh, Erica's moving all the bodies into here. So we have uh, three out of four human corpses, and actually three in there, four more to go. Is that what that means? Dead, dead aliens, too. Like in their little body bags. <laughs> we didn't have body bags before. Okay, so five in there, two to go, eight uh, alien, five to go. <laughs> wow, it's full of corpses, 20. Got 20 corpses in there. Gotta start eating. Well, some of it. We could be eating the algae tank stuff. It actually fills up pretty quick, doesn't it? That, that wonderful green water that Jeff is so familiar with. Is that the color of the green that you see all the time, Jeff? Is that the color of your water? Okay, down over here. It's pretty close. Green means the water is good. Oh, okay. I wasn't sure what that meant. So we're just picking up the infra scrap now. I guess we can leave. No, it's not that green, so it's just okay. Ah, uh, should get to work on that. Cools. What's the problem? No, oh, it's working. Tech stuff, but we got all the good tech blocks out of here. Okay, you guys are dumb. Don't need that anymore. Okay, so there. Okay, ready to jump. All we need to do is get our shuttle back and we should be good to go. We are. Come on. Okay, where are we going? Wow. Apparently there's not a whole lot of ways to go through here. Can't even get across there. That's no good. Oh, maybe we can. There we go. I'd go the long way.
action. Oh, that's us. Civilians? What are civilians doing here? Why are there no resources? There's some there. Wow. The system is... It's safe, but there's nothing to do here. <laughs> okay, let's just say. So, star system is unoccupied or under dispute between factions. So, with that one. Um, it's this one. Controlled by a baron of the frontier, a rich retired owner of a large space station. Hmm. Star systems is known to have a lot of alien activity. Really? Let's go this way. Oh, I guess you can check out that area. Okay. Oh, this is not what I meant to do. Not what I meant to do. Another accident, Vu Cruels. <sighs> Must have a klutzy stat or attribute, because that's what he is, he's a klutz. Look, stuff. All kinds of stuff. Okay, we're going to drop down here and do some mining, check out that derelict. We get lucky. <laughs> we need tech blocks. Lots of tech blocks. Uh, let's see. Just mine everything. That beat up. It's not necessarily a bad thing. Everybody's healthy enough. Into the shuttle. Didn't we get? Come everybody's not on board. Where's the other person? Where's the slacker? I don't see him. Somebody's avoiding their uh, military duty here. Oh, he's mining. Never mind. He snuck out of there too fast. They can do three. They'll be fine. Hmm. 
who's not here. Okay. Oh, this is a heavily infested ship. Shit, 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 shit. Where are you going? No, oh, where's it going? <laughs> and we lost somebody. We're losing people. What's the shuttle doing? They just all done. they're all unconscious now. Oh, this went wonderfully well. And look, they're eating them. They're eating them. Well, now. <laughs> ah. More dinner options now? I don't know. Biff's alive. He's stuck up against the wall, or she's up against the wall. So, oh, look, Don. That's a new person. Now they're going to take Luke Cruz. Luke Cruz is going to get stuck up against the wall, too. Unless he dies. Dun, 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 lonely. It's a serious health problems. Don't think he's dead. Yeah, it's going to, be going to be turned into an egg or incubator type deal. So, Captain Erica is our only only hope. Although, I think Lucas is dead. Unless they put him up against the wall here. No, Lucas is not dead yet. So... Yes, major discomfort. This went incredibly well. So, so well. So, I think Captain Erica has it in her. So, we lost Lieutenant Zion. Primary cause of death. Holler slash protein deficiency. Sure, make it look like it's my fault. Well, Captain Erica. Oh, oh, oh. Drafting. You gotta go on a rescue, a one man rescue mission here. Show us how. Do what captains do. Make Kirk proud. God, that's the ship is just oh. You know the the shuttle disappearing like that or backing off like that. I don't know why I did that. Incoming ship. Are they going to save us? Probably not. It's that time again. Drink some water to keep that brain moist. And she's down. Okay, so my only hope now is that uh, that military force that's coming in, I hope, Cult of New Haven. I don't think they're going to save us. <laughs> I think they're bug food. So Don's in here at least. Whoever Don is. It says she's not dead. It doesn't say she's dead yet. So where are they going to put her? Up against that wall, it looks like. Yep. So. Huh. 
<sighs> we have no way of rescuing them here because everybody's in here. Feeling a little hungry. I messed up. I messed up real bad. Why am I so clumsy? Wow. Ships take it forever to come in here. I don't think they're going to rescue us, though. They might steal my ship, but I don't think they're going to rescue us. Just want to see what they do. If they do anything at all, doubt they will. So at least they're talking to each other, it looks like. I mean, all it takes is a good couple of well-trained people to come in right here and you know, shoot these things. TA is in one hour. Seems longer than that. There they are. Trade allowed, but now oh, they're sending the shuttle over. Maybe they're here to rescue us. I think they actually might try to rescue us. It's going to be interesting. They're better at shooting than we are, apparently. Not by much, but... Rescuers, maybe. Oh, we lost Vukulus. I think Vukulus finally died. I don't know. It's not over yet. They're definitely killing better than we did. splitting up, though, for some reason. Draft this thing, get it over here so it's ready in position if we need it. Um, where's their third person? Splitting up to get it done quicker, white mean killed faster, because they're missing a third person. See, the third person is down. See, they're not invulnerable. Cleaning it out. Oh, geez. So I got to do all that stuff. Erica's gonna die. The third person is back up. Don seems very durable. He hasn't died yet. He's been here longer than anybody else. is going to die because they're not they're not helping us really they're killing the aliens but they're not really helping us but I don't really, I actually shouldn't expect them to help us because they're neutral towards us they're not like our allies or anything
No. Captain Erica's gonna die. Now they have to wait for their shuttle. And a fish. Uh oh. We're running out of oxygen. That's gonna do it. Biff is out of oxygen. Erica has plenty of oxygen, just no health. <laughs> so they're both gonna end up dead. They cleaned it up. Like I said, they're not actually going to rescue. Oh, they rescued Don. Does Don need a ride? Let's see if he gets on our shuttle. <laughs> nope. So Biff is dying from uh, lack of oxygen. Erica is just kind of like dying. She's probably bleeding to death or something. Hungry, injured. Aliens haunt me in my dreams. <sighs> Nobody wants to get up. Oh. oh, Biff's on the shuttle. But Biff is not alive. But he Biff is going to live more than likely, maybe. Captain Erica, not so much, because for whatever reason they didn't rescue her. is where is she did they take her where's Biff where is she oh she's in their shuttle are they taking are they stealing her from us Hey, Biff's up. Uh, so, Mr. Shuttle. So, how do we save Dom? So, uh, Erica apparently seems to be getting healed. Okay, Biff. Let's see if we can go save Don. See if Don wants to join us. Gonna be the three man crew at this fight at best. If Erica survives, of course. Okay, Don. Hey, look, we got the ship. Talk to, attack, take oxygen. Talk to Don. Don, thank you, God, you're here. I was worried I'd be hanging in here forever. Ask him what happened. Uh, it's a, 
He talked for a time, and that's how it had end up hanging on the wall with my crew running away yelling, Hang in there, Don. <laughs> you don't want to return to them. Can I join your crew? Sure, you're welcome to join my crew. Okay. Then where'd our thing go? Don's joined us. Ugh. So, that was messy. Plus one, minus one. Actually, it's plus one. Yeah, I'm getting a plus one, minus one. If we can get uh, Erica back, at least. Because she's actually not on our ship. She's on somebody else, on the other ship. Salvage. Transfer all this stuff. Oh, there's Ru Cruz's body. Might be lunch. See, she's over here somewhere. There she is. So she's resting. Somehow we have to get her out of there, right? Can we communicate with these guys? Hail. Cannot hail. Operations offline. Can we get on there? She's not conscious yet. Resting. It's Don. Oh, Don is doing stuff for us. Good. Good, Don. Feeling ill. Protein deficiency. Feeling comfortable, though, for some reason. Probably because it's a bigger room and everything. Her health just like, dropped in that. <laughs> so that was a disaster. Hop off the shuttle and there are all the bugs in your face. And it's gone. I knew that was going to happen. I knew that was going to happen. Does it make the alarm work? Or is it retired? Um... I don't know. He's not in here. It's a little early still by a couple of minutes. So. Our captain. <laughs> she was she was resting on another ship and they left. <laughs> uh, statistics research maintenance jobs. So. Don and Biff. Um, so Don. Okay, neither one of them does medical. Great. I think it's construction, maintenance, maintenance priority. It's mining though. No research really. Logistics. Ugh. So. We're in trouble. <laughs> I mean, they I don't think they're going to die of like starvation or anything, but I mean, between the two of them, they can keep the ship running for a while because they both are. We have somebody to do maintenance. That's the important part. Mining. So that's not a big deal. If we were growing plants, that would be okay. But we have nobody really to do research. That's going to be a problem. Call me crazy. Entry 5. Oh, they found Eden. So beautiful. 
I guess if you're listening to this, you don't need me to tell you what it looks like. Congratulations, you found Eden too. We're down there somewhere. Hopefully we're scratching out a life. So they found Eden. I'll have to go back and read that stuff someday. So. <laughs> so plus one, minus three. Is still hurting. So, Dom. Aliens haunt me in my dreams, mind of discomfort. So, he's not. He doesn't have all the vitamin the deficiencies yet. Lonely awake, aliens haunt me in dreams, work, skills. I didn't even look at. So, he's a miner, construction, navigation. A little bit of weapons. Of course, does he even have a weapon? He's got a pistol. He's got the 5.7 pistol. He's got a shotgun. <sighs> love this game. Gotta love this game. So I don't think you can really research in botany to give us a little bit of food. Because, like I said, we have everybody to do stuff. We've got construction, we've got maintenance, we have mine, we have a little bit of industry. You don't need a lot of that. Researching that'll take a while, which is no big deal. Botany. Medical is, I guess, the only scratch, sketchy one. Well, I don't know. Could be worse. Yeah, everybody could be dead. We might find Captain the captain later on, because she's not dead. Is that she was on the ship that uh, rescued her. Instead of letting us rescue her, instead of putting her on our shuttle, they took her. I don't know if we'll ever run into her again, though. It's possible. I mean, that ship is still in the system. Ships tend to not leave systems. So we can find them again. We might be able to, but we have no way of hailing them. That's the only problem. We don't have that technology right now. But even then, I don't know if they'd give her back to her. I don't know if they'd give her back. What you've done? Where's everybody went? Ben, though, no, they got... Uh... We went over to this ship, which is, was infested by space bugs. And as soon as they walked out of the airlock, boom. <laughs> Luckily, Biff was the only one that didn't... Biff was busy. I think Biff was doing the was doing mining, right? I think. I think that's, that's why Biff didn't go over. No, Biff was here. Who was the other person that didn't come over? Gimpy, I am sorry to say this. But it is time to end the stream. After I explain this. Say goodbye to all of the nice people and make sure you tell them to have a great day or evening. We will see them again tomorrow. Also, make sure to remind them to hit the follow button and visit your YouTube channel. Okay. So, what happened was, we had, one person was out mining, right? And we sent three over here. As soon as they walk out the airlock, they get ran over by a bunch of aliens. And we weren't able to get back into the shuttle. Uh, and what happened then was one person was killed right there in front of the airlock. And then I think it was Biff and Vukruels. That's right, yeah. Biff, Biff and Vukruels were knocked unconscious. And then they got put up on the wall. They were basically going to be, you know, alien food. And then our miner who was our captain, we brought her back over to try to attempt a rescue, but all she had was a pistol. And she got knocked unconscious, and she got put up on the wall by the aliens. Then, 
before that, even before that that was happening, there was a a neutral ship coming into the system, and it took them a little while to get there. But once they did, um, you know, all our remaining crew were stuck to the walls, and they came in. the The other guys came in and they killed all the aliens, and they put Biff into our shuttle that was connected to the airlock at the time. And then for some reason they left our captain up on the wall. They didn't rescue her or they didn't put her in our shuttle, but they left her there. Um, but what they did do is they took her and put him on their shuttle and brought him back to their ship where she was resting last time we saw her, but then they warped out. So she's no longer with us that way, but we picked up Don here. Who was he was actually somebody stuck under the wall when we first got there he's just some random guy and we basically read he was freed by the by the other guys too they, they they caught him down on the wall but he was conscious so he was walking around and stuff but then we had biff uh recovered came become conscious and uh he was back on our ship came back over um had him talk to don don says hey can i join you blah 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 so we did so now we're down to two people we started today with four people <laughs> We could have been up to five, but that didn't happen. So now we're down to two. Hey, Fanny, welcome back. Oh, yeah, it was fun. So, anyway, research. Now we can grow food if we want. Autop autopsy table. This is an important thing because we have a problem with the um, um, proteins. Proteins. So, that's where we are. But now the ship belongs to us. It's a it's a derelict, but we get to salvage it and whatever. With the two people that we currently have. Don and Bip. So they're doing stuff. They're not salvaging though. I don't know why they're not salvaging. Oh, probably because I'm not prioritizing them correctly. construction thing that I'm not sure how uh, salvaging works <sighs> anyway fun stuff said to love this game <laughs> love this game anyway I do need to call it a day dinner's gonna be ready here shortly so thank you all very much for watching very much appreciated and this is fun and again this is uh, Space Haven Alpha 13 update good stuff lots of changes well maybe not changes but additions they put a hey this um they changed the way technology it's uh this tech tree they played around with how this works um basically now you can uh, get some technology picked up while you do salvaging on derelicts and that kind of stuff not that one of course, we don't have it. This is this is what we're currently researching. What we have? Oh, no, this is this is what we have researched on this one. X1 hyperdrive. So basically, what works works uh, work, the way it works now is when you go onto a ship that uh, you can salvage or claim or whatever, and you break that and you do you know the salvaging bit, you get a chance to pick up some research points for that particular piece of equipment if you don't already have the. The, the tech for it in this case weapons consoles and shields consoles consoles we haven't worked on this these at all yeah we picked up some points because we salvaged them a couple of times on some derelicts and stuff so we got a couple of points working towards that it's not a lot but it saves a little bit of time not a lot but time um, so that's kind of a night and of course then they uh, group the, the actual technologies into groups so you can actually see what they do and then they added these nice little features where you can uh, click on the tech, what it's supposed to be. And then it's over here on the left. And you can see, oh, look, it's an item fabricator. And you click on that and it tells you what it does and what you're going to need to build it and that kind of stuff. That's a nice feature. So that, you know, get your uh, prior, to help you prioritize stuff. Um, what else? Oh, and then this uh, particular scenario that I'm doing is brand new. Um, you know, before it was. You start on a little base and you have to build your ship from scratch and all fun that way. This scenario is instead of that, you get a, this nice little ship first. It's got all the basics. Um, you got a shuttle, you got a pod, 
for mining. You get some of uh, the basic engine stuff, basic reactor. Um, they give you a research uh, lab to work with and this uh, research workbench to help you with that too. So again, it's a very basic little ship. You get four crew members. You can customize it. You can have more crew members if you want, but yeah, they don't have a ton of supplies. So you have to, you know, go out and start exploring fairly quickly to get your food and you know, research your stuff, do salvaging, all this other fun stuff to uh, progress. It's a little challenging, but it's not too bad. It's kind of fun. And uh, it's a nice little addition. I'm glad they put it in. Uh, what else? Um, I don't know if there's a lot. They still have it. It's not that. No, there it is. Okay, if you're interested in reading the hatch notes and everything, I'll put them in the chat. There you go. So, lots of stuff. <laughs> lots of stuff they put in with this update. So, the game is very much still being worked on. And it's fun. I like this game. Oh, that's right. It's currently on sale, too. This game is currently on Steam on sale for 33% off. Again, it is still early access. Keep that in mind. Um, I recommend it. It's fun. Especially for an early access game. Still good. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. Okay, so that's going to be it for today. So stream schedule. We only got, uh, after today, three more days left. 31 games and 31 days for Extra Life. Uh, tomorrow we're playing Mech Order 5. Saturday is Stellaris. And Sunday, I still haven't decided what I'm playing. So anyway, tomorrow, Friday, st stream starts at noon Pacific, 3 p.m. Eastern, 8 p.m. GMT for some more Mech Order 5. That'll be it. Thank you all very much for watching. I know you have many other viewing choices here on Twitch. I really do appreciate it when you choose to spend your time with me. So thank you very much. Have a great evening, great day, wherever you happen to be. Stay safe, stay healthy, and I will see you tomorrow.